Prince Harry hates being stripped of military roles after leaving royal job. According to a royal expert, Prince Harry is not at all happy that he lost his military affiliations after he and Meghan Markle resigned as members of the royal family because he feels he could have done more to support the armed forces. Welcome to Royal Expert if you're new here don't forget to subscribe and click the notification bell so you don't miss any news about the British royal family. Prince Harry hated being stripped of all his military affiliations when he and Meghan Markle stepped down from their royal roles, an expert has claimed. The Duke of Sussex served for more than a decade in the military and also received several honorary military titles bestowed upon him by his late grandmother, the Queen. In 2014, he also created the Invictus Games, a Paralympic-style sports competition for injured and ill military personnel and veterans. However, when he and Meghan decided to dramatically leave the UK, his honorary titles, which include Captain General of the Royal Marines, were put under review and were stripped of them a year later. Before the 2023 Invictus Games start in the German city of Dusseldorf later this week, Royal biographer Robert Jobson says that Harry hates the idea that he has lost all these military positions. He told True Royalty TV's The Royal Beat that King Charles would be absolutely proud of what his son has achieved with Invictus but added, now I think what the king feels is what a waste. It's great that he does these things but the king might have wanted him to stay in an organization like the army or the armed forces. I just think if he had been supported in that way, he would have done it. There are a lot of things to the royal family. Now which he would probably enjoy. Before the 2023 Invictus Games start in the German city of Dusseldorf later this week, royal biographer Robert Jobson says that Harry hates the idea that he has lost all these military positions. He told True Royalty TV's The Royal Beat that King Charles would be absolutely proud of what his son has achieved with Invictus but added, now I think what the king feels is what a waste. It's great that he does these things but the king might have wanted him to stay in an organization like the army or the armed forces. I just think if he had been supported in that way, he would have done it. There are a lot of things to the royal family now which he would probably enjoy. Harry was previously a Captain General of the Royal Marines. He hates the idea that he's not Commander-in-Chief of the Royal Marines. And he hates the fact that he lost all these positions. If he had been in the Royal Family, and not gone down that path, I think he would have done that. He would have greatly benefited the country, and he could have done more. Meanwhile, the king has no time in his diary to see his son Prince Harry during the latter's brief return to the UK, a royal insider has claimed. The Duke of Sussex returns to the UK to attend the Well Child Awards this week, almost a year after the late Queen's death. Despite this anniversary, it is understood that there will be no family reunion. A palace insider has reportedly confirmed to the Mail on Sunday that the king has no time in his diary to see his son upon his return to the UK. It is understood that Harry was also not invited to Balmoral for the company's annual summer holiday. Since the Duke of Sussex has already returned the keys to his favourite home, Frogmore Cottage, it remains unclear where he will be staying while in the country. It is also understood that there are no plans for him to see his brother Prince William either. Harry is set to take a short solo trip to the UK without Meghan before heading to the Invictus Games in Germany, where the Duchess will later join him. Thanks for watching till the end.